Amen to the First Lady, to the board of members that are here, to True Word that's in the house. Amen to Pastor Cheryl, Dr. Williams. Thank God for you on tonight, First Lady of True Word. Amen. Amen. Pastor Powell. Amen. And to the honoree. Amen. It's such an awesome time. Amen. It's such an awesome celebration time to, to be in the house on tonight. Amen. To all the True Word that is here. Thank you all for coming out tonight. Amen. Praise God. We show some love. Amen. True word, just stand right quick. We're going to get the, all this out of the way. Amen. Amen. All the true word, just stand on tonight. Amen. Those that are here, thank you all tonight. Amen. Amen. We we know we got more folk, but only the faithful. Amen. Praise God. Thank you, ushers, on tonight. Amen. But there is a word from the Lord. Amen. Yes. I do understand where your theme is coming from, and, and I told him here at a true word that everybody that you walk in their house seem like they got that one scripture, Joshua 24 and 15. And it says, as for me and my house. But see, you, you, you got to go back. A, a, a scripture, and it said, choose you this day. Amen. Who you going to serve. Amen. So in other words, choose this day whom you going to serve. But we're we, we going to go a little further than that because I wanted to, I wanted to, to encourage this woman of God, I, I, I thank God that, amen, we're here. But I want you to go to Nehemiah, Nehemiah chapter number four. Amen, Nehemiah chapter number four. Amen, on tonight, I, I've always wanted an opportunity to come in this house. I never got a chance. I always drive by, I'm always doing something. I do drive-bys and... Amen. I know Pastor Connolly. Amen. And I thank God for him. Amen. Amen. But I finally got a chance to come in this house. Amen. Amen. And it's a beautiful house. Amen. Amen. I'm letting y'all know I'm scouting out the land. <laughs> Tell the Pastor I'm scouting the land out. Amen. And I love it. It's beautiful. Yeah. Amen. Whenever you can have an edifice that you can honor. Yes. Amen. Amen. And praise God. And I thank God for the work. Amen. If you will. If you don't mind, will you stand for the reading of God's word? Amen. Nehemiah chapter number four. Amen. And, and verse number three, we want to look at very quickly. Amen. And we want to do more of a teaching tonight. Amen. If that's all right, Pastor, we, we want to do more of a teaching in, a, uh, in, in the word. Amen. It says this in verse number three. I am reading out of the King James Version. Now Tobiah, the Ammonite, was by him. And he said, even that which they build, we talk about building, right, Pastor? Yes. Even which that they build, mm. if a fox <laughs> mm, God. go up, he should even break down their walls. Uh -oh. We want to talk on the subject, basically encourage you, Pastor, teaching and preaching in building in the midst of all these foxes. Mm -hmm. Amen. You may be seated. Teaching, preaching, and building. See, because there are some folk that are preaching but ain't teaching. Come on now. Amen. There are some folks that's preaching, teaching, but they ain't building. Amen. They tearing folk down. Amen. All right. Not only that, Pastor, but I, I wanted to encourage you in the season that we're living in. And, and, and I want to share with somebody that don't know me. Praise God. As my wife asks you if y'all know me, anybody that know me know that I'm not going to beg you to say amen. Amen. I'm not going to use my whole sermon trying to get you to say something you ought to say anyway. Amen. amen. If you agree. But if you don't agree, just sit there, listen, and we'll soon be out of your way. Amen. amen. But, 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 but in order to understand Nehemiah, you got to go back to his history. You got to go back. When he got permission from the king. Because he received a letter from home. That the walls have been torn down. And I love what I love about Nehemiah. I love the respect because even though he was in a high position. He still humbled himself. And said I'm going to ask the one that has rule of authority over me. I'm going to ask the king if I can go back. That's good, that's good. Now the king could have easily said no. But, but, but see, when you're connected with somebody, Come on he said the king even saw the sorrowful look on his face. Yes. Yes. It, 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 it's 
something, Pastor, when, when we can look at our members or we can look and we can understand there's something going on with them. Yes. Amen. E even when we know, the Bible said the sheep knows the shepherd's voice. Yes. No other voice they're going to hear. That's right. But the Bible declares that Nehemiah was feeling kind of lonely, feeling kind of bad. He wanted to go home. Not that he was homesick. But he found out his home was in trouble. All right. Preaching, teaching, and building in the midst of foxes. Uh -huh. and, and, and Pastor, I want to drop a pin there real quick. That not, not only do we have small foxes. Come on. We got some big foxes too. Uh, I think I'm going to say that. What, what is a big fox? They in a pool pit. Right. Hello somebody. They, they, they in a pool pit. They, 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 they're not going to honor what God has called you to do. I, I don't care how long you've been in this thing. We, we seem to have separatism that, 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 in the house of God. Amen.
some and some to the door. That's right. But look at Nehemiah. Mm. Nehemiah didn't let it get to him. That's one thing I love about his character. Yes. No matter what Nehemiah was doing, no matter what they said, he stayed faithful to the world. Yes. He stayed faithful no matter what, and he stayed faithful. Yes. Uh, somebody ought to shout that even when you're in the choir. You may get out of two or three, but stay faithful. Right. Amen. You may not have a musician to play, but stay faithful. Yes. Amen. You may not have nobody to shout when you sing, but stay faithful. You may not have nobody to say amen, but preach faithful. You stay faithful, Pastor. No matter what. And I'm a firm believer. I'm a firm believer. And it will pay off. And I'm going to tell you something. When you're faithful yes. and you keep up the work, some of the same ones that stayed around to see you fall, yeah. they're going to be there in the midst of you rising up. Right. But they're going to be the very ones still trying to pull you down. Right. You stay faithful. Yeah. You stay faithful. You stay faithful. I don't do nothing else but encourage you tonight. Oh, to God, you stay faithful. Yeah. Every tear that you shed is not going to go unnoticed. Yeah. Everything that you do. Nehemiah tonight mm. said, well, I'm going to keep on working. Mm. I don't know about y'all, but I was telling them that true word, God gave me a revelation. Even the 14 years since we started true word, we've had some ups and downs. And one morning, Pastor McClendon, I looked at my time. And I was sitting in my office getting ready to go preach. And God said, I need you to look at the towel that's in your hand. And he said, every time you think about throwing that towel in, I want you to look at every other towel that's over there in that basket. Because as soon as you throw that towel in, I got another one coming right back at you. Because he said, he that has begun a great work in you yeah. is able to complete it. Y'all yeah, yeah, better catch that towel mentality. Yes. Amen. Don't throw in the towel yet. That means it, it ain't over yet. It ain't, it ain't over. Yeah. And I'm going to tell you something. I want to encourage you that something that I messed up on. Yeah. Don't go to looking at the number. That's yeah. right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have a slow growth. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Amen. Uh -oh. Bless it. The Bible said He made me to lie down in green pastures. He leaded me beside. Y'all ain't catching that then. I'm going uh, 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 I'm staying topside right now. I'm staying topside. But look, 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 look let's let's dip in, in chapter number four. Because I done gave you it said when it came to pass that when Sam Mattic heard, it came to pass. That when your people heard, when your people heard, oh, she gonna do what? She starting to what? 